Now, I could just jump straight into the water. Yeah. You jump into uh, colossus infested water. Oh, it's a, it's a colossus. It won't eat me. Um, It'll like float around uselessly for a while. I honestly thought you were going to have to go to the top of that. Uh -oh. oh, this looks interesting. <laughs> it's got catfish thing. This is awesome. <coughs> so it's a, it's a cat eel. Here. He losses. I like that one. I mean, I'm. I mean, I'm not. I'm kind of stumped as to how you're actually going to reach this guy. Well, we know he's got the, this guy has got the draw strength of an absolute lunatic. He is aware of you. Like, I'm a little wary of, you know, grabbing the electric thing. Yeah, I would I would recommend that as a strategy. <coughs> oh, uh, okay. This is not gonna. No, I don't need to do that. Right. Uh. Make ourselves the tasty prey. Yeah, it looks like it. Oh, wait, what was that? Wait, was that its tail? Yeah, something made an impact in the top of the <laughs> Yeah, I'm not very comfortable with it to be fair. No, no, I'm swimming out a huge body of very deep water. So we swim on the surface, right? He does that kind of attack again where the tail comes up. Yeah. I just don't get where you're meant- I think you're meant to grab the whiskers. That would be my guess. Grab the whiskers? Well, they're the only part that's not really electrified that I could think about, right? So saying that we'd actually have to be slamming him underwater? Yeah, I think so. Ugh. Oh yeah, you're supposed to be dying. I completely forgot that you can do that. Yeah, there you go, you can see. That makes sense. Okay, so. We thought about here. It comes up, and then... As it's like passing beneath us, we have to swim forwards. And that makes sense to me. We stand here. So it's fake. 
Right, and... Oh, I've got demo in this. It's a little bit difficult to do, because what you're... It's quite difficult to see where the electrical storms are going to show up. Yeah. Does it mean we can zoom out the camera? No, it's pretty much set. You can move it around, but you can't zoom out. Yes, boys, we figured it out. It's quite tricky. I think by design. Yeah, it also looks like our, this basically absolutely confirms our theory about how the eyes work. Yeah. I don't quite get why it's angry. I mean, it's not like we've done anything to it yet. It's kind of eat us. I mean. So then this we can watch. Okay, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna be a little bit for and stop. Oh, got it. Ah, yes. Okay. Oh, right. We're gonna run out of stamina very quickly. Unless it's going to oblige us by going above board. Oh, okay. Treat us to some air. Okay. Right. Okay. It's willing to surface. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, this is really cool. So it looks, it looks like the weak points are just behind. Yeah, there it is. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's interesting. So we're going to have to either get rid of it very quickly or no, two. Okay, no, because it's electricity can only spark, right, when... Yeah. It hits the water. Yeah. So. Oh this... god, damn. You're not. Ah. Okay. That isn't how I meant this right. Okay, that's done. Yeah, dead. We done all the... Ah, and also looks like it's killed the its ability to generate electricity here. Yeah, this makes sense, right? Ow. Now we kind of just have to hang on and hope our stamina lasts. No, we're not gonna last, are we? How do I swim up game? Hmm. Yeah, that's pretty tricky, isn't it? Yeah. Because each time we cling on to the. Well, because if it just goes too deep like that, there's nothing we can do, right? <coughs> well, maybe it acts like a timer. We've only got a set amount of time before. Come on, notice us. Right here, class of strength, right here. He's, well, he, knows, he knows where we are, and he's just not getting mad just yet. He's calmly curving around that. Uh, 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 oh, there he is now. Oh, it's taking us for a loop this time. Uh, on, surface, surface, surface. Should be over there. I think, I think, I think.
It looks like your stamina recovers super fast, by the way. Maybe it's uh, stamina loss from being underwater. Right, makes sense. Yeah, you can see there we got the full bar again. Some power behind that weapon on that. Right, okay. I should kill that. Yeah, let's kill it. Where's the last one then? It's on the back, you yeah. see? It's just behind it, that's it. There we go. Okay. Oh god damn it! Stab it was no one learned the word. Now, what? That's a really, really hard timer. Actually, remember, stab economy. I am trying very hard to remember stab economy. Z, gonna come on, service just one, just once more. No, no. Quickly. There's nothing I can do. I uh, the other two just went the surface very easy. Oh. Is he not? It doesn't kill you for running out of stamina underwater. It just forces you to surface. Oh, okay. Oh, 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 what is this? He actually automatically buys the surface. Yeah, yeah, I could. Oh, I, I wasn't see. doing any of that. I see, I see. Come. Come here. Look, I'm a nice, tasty treat, even though you don't have electricity anymore. Now we, now we can line up because there's no way he can fire up because he can yeah. use it so. There we go. Now we cling on for a bit. Cling on for a bit while he takes us on a ride underwater. No, until he's dead. This is probably my favorite fight now. But <laughs> it's just so tense. And I can imagine like mastering this kind of fight would be really, really fun. Yeah. Like, can you kill him in one phase would be a really interesting one. I reckon that would be easily possible, but with a, some a lot of a lot of practice. I wonder if this game would have like a boss rush in it or something, or would that just be too gamey? You know? Oh, 
Essentially this game essentially this game is a boss rush. Oh, they're not. It's really tricky. Now Okay, one more. Just don't go, don't go to the end. One more. Got him. You fought honorably. Catfish eel. Eelosus. Bloss eel. Doesn't feel right. Yeah, I'm not too happy about playing that guy. Yeah, I feel like. You were too fun to kill. Yeah, yeah he was too interesting. I, I would have wanted to let him go, you know? Like a, a fish you caught. You go, I could kill you fish. But I'm gonna let you go and go back into the sea. Poor oh, Ross. That's the fish. Plaster. Then back into the river. Exactly, and right? And catch him again the next day. Yeah. And he gets a tree out of it. You get the cat satisfaction of having caught something. I I feel like that will be better. I feel bad for playing this game. Maybe I'm a fisherman at heart. Maybe you're not entirely solid after all that. Yeah. It's like, you know, beard losses. Eh, I'm not too bothered about killing him. Father Jack. Father Jack is just he was a bit of a moron, he died easily. Didn't really put up much of a fight. He fell for the same trick twice. But like... Eelossus was just like floating around, you know? Exactly. You just invaded his area. Oh. Same with the horse. <laughs> Can it be another humanoid one so I don't feel bad? I don't think it's another humanoid one. Oh, the crawls on the walls. An ominous feeling about this one. Giant spider. Oh god, if it's a giant spider, I'm giving you the controller. I, I'm... Or I'm stabbing it with such glee that... You won't be able to deal with it. I freaking hate spiders. Even a tiny little jumping spider. Yeah, they're the most horrifying because they can jump on you. What, and you think they're going to eat you? Or they're going to paralyze you during your sleep and suck out your vital fluids? I know, they might climb into my mouth. <laughs> that is an urban legend. Spiders would have to be. You'd, ha you'd have to be sleep. You'd have to be basically sleeping like a corpse for a spider to crawl into your mouth. A spider hears, you know, all, you know the rhythmic beating of your heart, you know. And then it like, goes for it because loud, it's a killing machine. The loud, like sounds of like of you know, of you breathing, and it knows that. Wait a minute, this is you know something's not right here. You know this is a big creature. You know, let's not go near it. And then it tries to lay eggs inside of your face. Okay. Because that's what spiders are. They're evil, and if there is one, I'm going to kill it. I mean, you're more likely to get parasitized by flies, like bot fly. But then again, if you've got spiders around to eat the flies. All insects you just think are horrifying things. Oh, well, that's alright then, because a spider's an arachnid. All arachnids are horrifying things. All creepy crawlies are horrifying things. All, you're saying what? All arthropods then? Yes. Okay, what about. Um, Apart ooh. from ladybirds, ladybirds are cool. Okay, well, okay. Okay, so. They are on the like exception list for being cool. What about velvet worms? I don't know, I've never seen a velvet worm before. This is a truly depressing display of your taxonomic knowledge. Look, what I'm going to say is this. We will find out whether it is a spider next week, and I will murder it Even if it like is a spider. Even like little tiny spiders that, you know, just go down from the ceiling and go right, right in front of you. Yeah, like, they're horrifying. You know, if a spider builds a web across my doorway in the morning, I actually, I, I actually go around it or crawl underneath it so that I live. That web, web is up. a hair hazard. It can get in your hair and there's a spider in your hair and no. 
No, none of this is allowed. No. And then you got a bunny for the day. <laughs> so I get to see the world. Okay. I'm gonna stop this. Okay, I can see now actually, like. He's, like We're gonna stop slight, this. Slight, slight scratching of his skin now. This is the end of the video. Thank you very much it's for watching, everyone. Scratch. We'll catch you all next time. Pathetic. <laughs>